Welcome ladies and gentlemen to episode 40 of Maze Griffin Bounty Hunter. Last time I kind of slightly rage quit because I kept on dying and having to redo in a very annoying dogfight. I made it through the dogfight and I've made it here and now I am very ever so carefully going to <laughs> try and finish this game without rage quitting again. I've used made extent. I just went for the boom cannon. I was like, screw it, I'm going all out. If they're gonna have boom cannons, then I need to use my boom cannon. But now I've got barely any ammo for it, so let's hunt for ammo. Not the ammo I was wanting, but ammo nonetheless. I'll take it. A bunch of cameras. Oh look, more temple guys. A lot of temple guys. So many temple guys for us to brutally murder. If I die, if I don't hit a checkpoint within the next 10 seconds game. Not gonna lie, it was brutal getting past this fight. This, this fight, this fight was quite brutal. But we made it. Now, I want a damn checkpoint. Thank you. Right. Now that I've got a checkpoint, I don't feel so annoyed. I know I took a lot of damage there, but it's okay because I can retreat and recuperate. Thankfully, there was a lot of health packs down here. I know it's slightly bothersome having to trail back to grab them, but I would rather be inconvenienced slightly than die a lot. Well, back up to 93, that's fine. I was hoping for a hundred, but I'll take 93. So this is definitely the final level, and I'm on two minds whether or not to just keep on going until I finish it, because it's like midnight and I'm working in like six hours. Right. We are not sparing anyone. These acolytes are in cahoots with the Watchers, essentially. They're part of the, the problem. So we will not be sparing a single one. See, they're... See, even the... They have guns. All of them have guns. It's... And there's a turret right up there. No, there's not, not anymore. All right, we're getting there. We're making progress. What's my actual objective? Uh, pursue Victor and retrieve the disc. Oh damn! Let's do this. Oh, epic finale music. That's what that is. I got a little bit surprised by him, won't lie. Oh, 
Oops. Whoa. That was a mistake. I thought he was dead. Right, this looks safe, but we all know when this game looks are completely and utterly deceiving. Now I have stronger weapons that I could be using, I'm just trying to use up all my ammo as much as I can first. Before switching to more high powered weapons. This is going to be one tough corridor to fight down. Let's go, let's use up the last of our bullets. Spell, we're probably gonna grab some more ammo from these guys, but I think if I'm right, I am not right. I thought there was gonna be loads of guys down there that I could like take down take out from up here. There was not. I know there's definitely way more guys than what I killed though. Wait, that's me out of launchable grenades, sadly, and that is a boom guy. I saw that purple streak, I saw it. We are not taking any chances. There is a boom guy in there, I swear there is. It's him all the way over there, I think. I hate boom guys. Boom guys scare me. I don't know what his plan was. I really don't. The boom guy's still alive, which makes me nervous. Right, I think that was a boom guy that I just managed to kill. If so, that was great because one less boom guy is always much needed. Oh, and lots of goodies in here. Damn it. What is that glass freaking made of? Seriously. What are you made of to survive that? I think I've cleared out the majority of this room. I'm so nervous.
when a boom guy's around, it just... the nerves. No mercy. Right. I think this is where the boom guy may have been. There's got to be some form of enemy in here, right? No? Just these acolytes? Okay, fair enough. Well, let's head down this way. This is where my objective markers. Oh, hello! Poor guys, they did not stand a chance, did they? Oh, okay, here we go. At least we have a checkpoint. I really need to start saving this for more important enemies. Intense battle music. Very intense. Where did, I, where did I pick up grenades for this gun again? I'm not gonna question it. Right, okay, I spotted some good supplies right here. Let's grab them. Secure this room just to make sure nobody's gonna pop up from behind and like flank me. Cause that the game takes to do likes to do that in like later levels. Okay, maybe I'm not gonna go that way. Okay, maybe I, I maybe I will, but I need to. This is probably one of those occasions. Am I even going the right way? I mean, I did see a way down here. Let's check this out. It seems safer. I worry about those guys just in case the event they end up hitting me out with a, a grenade, essentially. Well, let's progress. This fight's quite intense, actually. This level's intense. Nope. I have no idea where I'm going. I'm just following the enemies, but I'm doing the right thing. I got a checkpoint, so...
Alright, let's go. I did see somebody that wasn't one of their order guys. That may have been Victor. Oh, hello. Yeah, he is a grenade guy. Uh more grenade guys. I spotted another grenade. Somewhere someone shot a grenade. Oh maybe it's actually not a grenade, maybe it's a rot and I'm out of my assault rifle ammo. That's kind of not good. Right, let's go. Right, okay, things are getting a little bit dicey. What am I out on? Oh, I've picked up some more ammo for this. Decent, I suppose. But... Oh, I've not got any ammo for that. Oh, okay, I'm not liking this. It's time to use this gun. Look at that, there's like three of them down there. Loads of guys everywhere. At least I know we're going the right way because there's so many dudes. I know there was a little alcove in there, but I kept on freaking missing it. Kept on missing the little alcove that I was trying to like escape into there. But that's not where I need to go, thankfully. I have 340 shots left of this. Oh, okay, where... what's going on? Oh. Let's find our way through the vents. This game loves its vents. If I get jumped as soon as I get off this ladder... Not only jumped, but jumped by a boom guy. Great game. Well, that's that, that's that's fair. That's very very fair. Follower directives offline. All right. So I don't know what I done, but I pushed this button and it said follower directives offline, and I really 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 hope that means I'm going to be able to go up this without getting shot. Yes. So I think this guy needs to die though. Because of you killing me. And I want your gun for your ammo as well. So all of the Order of Light guys are now, I wouldn't say friendly, but they are non-aggressive, non non-hostile. Which is great. So I need to get to the bridge now, and hopefully I have zero, like, enemies on the way. Because these guys are all like, yeah, we don't care anymore. Oh, that turret still cares though. It's a bit weird. It's actually killing its own guys. Feels good to just be able to walk by all these guys. Ugh, oh, man, if I have had to if I had to fight them all.
I have no idea what's going on there. They're fighting each other, by the looks of things. Well, someone's shooting at me, but I'm not really caring. What the hell is going on here? I don't have time to explain. Listen, can you remember anything? Uh, yeah, yeah, it's kind of hazy. I, I knew what I was doing, I, I just couldn't help it. Yeah, yeah, I get the picture. All I need to know is can you pilot this ship back through the wormhole? I think so, but the wormhole has to be reversed if, if we're going to get back to the Wagner system. I'll take care of that. You just turn this ship around and wait here until I return. I mean, how? How exactly do you intend to do that, Mace? So we were taken through the wormhole to the Watcher's home system. So now we need to go in reverse the direction of the wormhole somehow. Oh, and these guys are here. Great. Let's not mess about with these guys. What is going on? I know I have 15 health left. No I don't, I have zero health. I before I lose my before I lose my head, let's see how far back I am. Thank goodness. That would have been a rage worthy moment. I don't have time to I wish when you hit Y it skipped everything rather than just individual lines. Right, is there any goodies? Probably not. Not here anyway. So yeah, looks like Tan and Corporation are back. They're here to kick up a fuss. They're fighting someone. I'm not sure who they're fighting, but they're fighting someone. And maybe the order. Yeah, as they're fighting the order. That's great. I think the order's on our side. Yeah, the order's on our side. Awesome. We're allies. We have friends. That doesn't look good. That ship that's coming in, it does not look good. This is going to be nasty. What are we going to fight? This is definitely an alien ship, so... Looks like it's actual watchers. Now, spoiler alert, I did... I did read ahead a little bit and I know the only one thing hurts these things this gun so you need to use this until it goes blue and then boom whack them with the alternate fire I'm very glad that I read up on that because I would have been so dumbstruck otherwise so let's go into the ship and control it. What a weird looking alien ship, as usual. It's weird how Mace just knows how to fly these things. Is that what I think it is? Another fight dogfight sequence. I 
I believe it is. And I only have one gun available. Let's do this. Hopefully first time around, but we'll see. I've learned to stop going for just the ones that you're targeting. Like, you can actually hit the ones you're not, obviously, but it didn't really occur to me to try and do that. It's just better, because you'll never run out of targets that way. Ooh, this is getting a little bit dodgy, if I say so myself. No missiles at all makes this dogfight really difficult, I think. There's so many of them, like, ugh. This is a dodgy fight. Ooh, but I'll make it. I don't think I've killed one yet. Why am I so confident? I've not even killed one. You're going down, so let's focus on fire on you just now. It would help if I actually aimed and hit you. It would be a benefit. One down. All that time to take out one enemy fighter. Come on, come on. I got I got another one. Oh, let's hold on, hold on, and let's go. The whole slowing right down thing and then using that to maneuver works really well in this game. I don't like what they're doing though, they're just clumping all around me though. Ooh, I'm taking some damage. Down to 76, but this dogfight isn't as bad as the last dogfight we did. Like at the beginning of the mission. Come on, go down. <laughs> go down. Stop being so stubborn, please. Keep on, they keep on crashing into me, like kamikaze style. Oh man. This is one long ass dog fight. And honestly... It's not that important for you guys to see, so I'm just gonna cut out to when I finally do it, because I still have like 10 left. Thank God, I made the right decision in cutting that out because that was an additional, I'd say, 10 minutes. An additional 10 minutes of me just flying about trying to hit these things. But thankfully it's done and I never have to do it again unless I die and have to do it again. <laughs> so, let's land into this alien ship. I'm sure nothing's going to go wrong with that. We're going to keep on going with this episode until I finish. Um, might make it extra long, but oh well. So there's my entry port.
Here we go. Okay, I lied. We're gonna end the episode here and we're gonna finish it next time. Thank you guys for being here for this episode. I appreciate the time spent watching here and as always, I hope you're well and as always, I hope to see you next time.